On the bottom, Paige. You were good. I'm waiting for you to be great. And next, Kendall. You didn't stick out to me. Next is Brooke. Next, Nia. You're third on the pyramid. You were third overall high score. And Mackenzie. And on top of the pyramid, going three for three, once again, is Maddie. shattered up normally in bed by now. Now I'll be all right, give me a minute. I'll wake up in a sec. Happy Christmas. Right, I'll give you one sec. Universe, what was that? 2022? More like 2022. I didn't ask for any of that stuff to happen. Now we're doing it again, and we're getting it right this time. I'd like to take this moment and really reminisce about all the positive things that happened to me in 2022. Wow, that was quick. Who's got the champagne? About to catch another face. Have a bottom, make them wanna bite. Yeah. I just wanna have a good night. I just wanna have a good night. Hold up, if you don't want that no. If you broke, then you gotta let him go. You can have anybody, any money, no. Cause when you. Pluto is very close to entering Aquarius for the first time since 1777. How will this once in a lifetime transit affect you? Well, the fixed signs Scorpio, Taurus, Leo, and Aquarius will feel the most intense pull towards transformation. They will no longer be able to put up a facade. Anything they're faking just to get by will be exposed and discarded. The cardinal signs Capricorn, Cancer, Aries, and Libra will mostly just be relieved that Pluto has left Capricorn finally. They'll take the slightly terrifying moments of the past 15 years as a way to build up resilience. Now the mutable signs Gemini, Virgo, Sagittarius, and Pisces went through a transformation of their own from 1995 to 2008. So they will experience this transit as more of a chance to transform their educational path or their healing or spiritual practices. Are you in the mood for a transformation or would you rather stay in place? She gonna keep her hands in my pants cause she a freak. I told her that I'm celibate and fucking by the week. Psych, bitch, I lied. I'm good, jealous. But, um, who the fuck was that, bitch?
every sign can expect in February. I'll also post horoscopes for each sign in the comments, so follow to bring my comments to the top. Leo Taurus Scorpio and Aquarius placements are going to be hustling to secure the bag from February up until March. The past three years have been extremely difficult for the fixed signs, with 2022 being one of the most difficult year for these signs. But all of the hard work and effort that they put in over the past three years is finally going to start paying off in February, and by March of 2023, these signs are going to be extremely successful and they'll be able to take it easy for the rest of the year. Gemini, Virgo, Sagittarius, and Pisces placements were struggling for three months, but in February, they get to be the luckiest signs. All of their hustle from the past three months is finally going to pay off. They're going to be attracting a lot of attention and their love lives are going to drastically improve. Aries, Cancer, Capricorn, and Libra placements had a really rough beginning to the new year. January was difficult. They were struggling through Mercury retrograde, but in February, they're going to have a major improvement in their love lives, careers, and finances. The cardinal signs isolated themselves in January, but they're finally going to break out of their shell and they're going to be having a lot more fun, excitement, and adventure in February. Who cries the most? Who is most likely to be rich? CEO, entrepreneur, born in 1964, Jeffrey, Jeffrey Bezos. Who is the gold digger? Who is the clumsy one? Who would move to another country? Who is the most childish? Into the thick of it. Into the thick of it. Into the thick of it. Ugh. Who is the gossip? You didn't hear this from me. But some little birdie told me. Who's snobbiest? I don't like your little games. Don't like your tilted stage. The role you made me play. I don't like your perfect crime How you laugh when you lie You said the gun was mine He's cool, no I don't like you But I got smarter, I got harder in the nick of time Honey, I rose up from the dead, I do it all the time I got a list of names and yours is in red underlined I check it once, then I check it twice Who's most likely to become a model? Who's most likely to travel the most? Who's most likely to do something stupid in front of their crush? Who's most likely to easily get into a fight? Who's most likely to become a strict parent? Who's most likely to get hurt and laugh really hard about it? What is going on inside their head?